Okay, so, hello guys, it's me, Gaming Star here, and today, I am back to, with another episode of Paper Mario, I almost said it again, Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Last time, we had basically gotten coops in our party, and we've also uh, got the keys, and now we're here in, uh, we can enter Hooktail, um, Hooktail Castle. This time, we can go ahead, and hopefully we can even, hopefully we can see Hooktail, I'm not sure, but let's see. So, let's go. Go we all right. <laughs> I actually did not expect that. <laughs> Holy crap! Oh my god, it actually kind of scared me. <laughs> oh my god! Holy crap! That actually kind of spooked me horribly. Ah, no, a dizzy dial. Oh my god. Really? <laughs> Damn it, why? Fuck. Really? Man. Come on. Oh my god, the game literally scared me. Holy crap. I need to heal. Oh, horribly. Finally! Okay, Shine Sprite basically heals everything. It also brings in more audience. Okay, you know what? Once I level up, I'm gonna go ahead and increase BP. We're gonna do that. Oh. Oh, no! <coughs> oh, God. These bones, they remind me of my father. There's, there's no doubt about it. It's my father. Dad! Um, wait. What's this? Mario, my father's clutching some kind of letter. Or at least his, uh, <laughs> bones are. So, what should I do? Should I read it? Yeah, read it. Go read it. Yeah, sure, read it. Why the hell not? Oh, okay. I can do this. I, I'll read it. <coughs> I came to this castle to destroy Hooktail, but I am stuck and can go no farther. So, this is the letter I shall know Hooktail's weaknesses for those who follow. The dread Hooktail cannot tolerate creatures that begin with C, crit, and end with it kit. So, cricket. Hidden somewhere in this castle is the item related to Hooktail's weakness. If one is to have any hope to defeat Hooktail, one must find the item. One last thing, it takes fault in the doom, that thing will use any trick to save itself. If you hope to defeat it, do not give up on your kindred nature and fall for its tricks. Alas, I do not have the strength to continue writing. Already this nails my eyes. My last words to go to my son, Colorado. <laughs> I love you, and I'm proud of what you've become. Ah, a son, Colorado, not Coops. <laughs> oh, oops. Um, yeah, I guess this isn't my father after all. <laughs> but this isn't my father, but I wonder if the pile of bones over there is my dad. A key. I don't think so, that's red. <laughs> you clearly don't value your lives much if you come to the castle to disturb us. You will go no farther from this moment on. You'll be nothing but bones! Let's go. Mini boss. Alright. 
You tried to throw a... Fuck you! You know what? Why even bother? my DP. Go ahead and uh, get some more DP because it's gonna be very useful. I might do HP in the next level. Let's do DP. Alright. Now I can equip the power bounce. There we go. Then we'll do HP plus once I get more BP. For now, we can't do that. So, let's go. <laughs> I didn't even see it. Okay, I admit, I honestly didn't even see that. Like, I actually didn't even see that at all whatsoever. Like, wow, okay. No, don't do that. Hey, no, okay. Why even bother? Spiked pouch! Damn, I never got that item before. Oh, shine sprite! Okay, shine sprite! Okay, so that's what I have here. Oh, interesting. Okay, that's very interesting. Get away from me! I don't want anything to do with you. There's that badge. It's actually what we need. Okay, so go here. We can't get to that yet. There's another black box. We're not gonna talk to it yet. This wall? How could you never bother reading that wall? This key? We got a black key. Let's go. I'm not gonna talk to it because honestly, it's kind of pointless. Um, Mario, look at that! Spike ceiling. Let's run. Alright, so we have 47 seconds. Ah, shit. What have I done? I'm an idiot.
Man, that was too close. Gotta shake it off. Ooh, gotta get this spooky chest. Got it. What the heck? Hey, guess it's been a long time since anyone came here. A real long time. Huh? You heard me. Wow. Wait a sec. If you can hear my voice, you must be some legendary hero or something. You're using that same bullshit again, really? Yeah. Or not! To be honest, I'm sure anyone with ears can hear me. But it sure is fun zigging people with that whole legendary hero bit. <laughs> Might as well. Oh! Hey, but seriously, folks, I was wondering if you could let me out of this chest. I've been locked in here so long, staring the cramp up like I was gonna believe. Let's find the key and let me out. Easy, right? I already have the key. Huh? What do you mean? You think I'll be cursed if you open the box? Ridiculous. Who would do that? Really? Wait in the box and curse folks? A real slime ball, that's who. But I'm not a real slime ball. I wouldn't be into such a thing. But that should be obvious. Look, if you help me out, maybe I'll help you out. You know, a little... I scratch your back, you scratch me mine. Except in reverse order. Of course, you don't have to if you really don't want to. But... Like finding a... Don't kill yourself. I've already got it. I'm so glad you found it unbelievable. Here you go. <laughs> Fool! Oh my god. <laughs> Why, only the most idiotic pun? Pony break? Don't want to escape like that. The castle's traps prevent anyone who's entered a place from ever leaving it. No matter which path you take, you faded to waste away in a slow, painful end. But wait, there's more. There's a great deal. I'll throw in a free curse. No charge. Ugly, ugly goo. <laughs> ah, your curse do fit and it serves you right. This curse is more cursely curse worth than any curse that's ever cursed you. For this curse makes you like a piece of paper when you press R. <laughs> but a curse who curses like me, no one. Oh, shut this frightful curse it is. Go on, press and hold R. Press and hold R now. Okay. <laughs> Basically, turn into paper. <gasps> Look at your stuff. How embarrassing for you. You sandwich skinny. <laughs> you understand what the curse means for you? Yes, shut up now, please. But farewell, you dumbbells. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. Right, so if we go here. There it is. So we got the, the attack FFX. Check it. This one knows me better. That's actually the sound effects that we need. So everybody got it. It actually, you know, see how it sounds like a cricket? That's what we need. Why did I do that? Over here! <laughs> okay. Alright, so we can't do much here. Let's go to the other side. Okay, let's go. Now that I got the key, let's get going. Okay. 
Okay, that's badge I'm gonna get later. Let's head for her. Let's go. Here we go. Heal ourselves real quick. Oh, that's cool. Rush gun. Life stream it. I went the wrong way. Damn it. Okay, you know what? Oh, wait, what? Okay, here we go. Huh? Oh my! Who's this handsome piece of cheese? I can't believe there are other thieves here besides me. Sounds very strange. Hey, hey, who are you? Me? Why, I'm Miss Meow, the globe trotty thief. Heard of me, sweetie? I heard there were rare and valuable badges here in this castle. That's why I'm here. But the real question is why are people like you roaming in such a rundown place? Uh, well, you see, we're here to be Hooktail and get the, um,. Crystal star? So, don't you think we'll let, the, we'll let you get the crystal star first, no matter how cute you are? Crystal star, you say? Mm -hmm. I didn't know a thing like that was hidden in this castle. It sounds intriguing. Perhaps I just heard something you didn't want me to hear, eh? <laughs> Darn. Oh, but that's okay. I mean, you were looking for the crystal star first. And I already found the badge I was after, so I'll let you get that, your crystal star. Heart. <laughs> what are you doing? Um, hey, what's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Heart, it means I must say bye-bye for now, Mr. Cutie. I know, it's sad, we must have met. And I already so time to say farewell. Alas, Heart. Oh my, you're so bold. Is that legal? <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. I have a little secret to share with you, Heart. Somewhere in this castle's a badge that'll help you beat Hooktail, so I've heard. I don't know what kind of badge it is. Maybe you found it already, maybe not. I already did. If you're going to buy Hook, I recommend finding that badge first. Well, take care, handsome mustache man. Let's get together again real soon. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I wonder what her story is. I bet it's an interesting one. Full of romance. Alright. You know what? Let's get these items over here. Mushroom. Key. Shine Sprite. And... Honey syrup. Alright, let's go. Okay, that's actually kind of spooked for a minute. What the hell? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I think we'll be able to be hooked up to this actually with that power. With our progress.
get this life shroom. Really? Alright, let's get going. I said open the fucking door, Mario. God damn. See? Get away from me! Stampede. Alright, there we go. I just wanted to get that badge. Okay, so the last stampede, basically what that does is that basically it's for a partner. Basically, it allows you to kind of like, basically allows the, um, the partner, let me see, in a nutshell, basically allows the partner to, uh, to drop the damage your ally takes by one, two, and then basically kind of like decreases the damage that, that they take. Pretty useful though. Especially if uh, you're going something tough like what the Pit of the Trials, for example. Which we're gonna get into later! You guys remember the Pit of the Trials? I nearly said flip side Pit of the Trials. Why did I say that? I don't know. I nearly did. I nearly said flip side for some reason. I guess it's part of my nature to say flip. Whenever I hear Pit of Trials, I say flip side or flop side. I don't know. It's just so common to me. So I'm sorry if I accidentally say flip side a lot. It's just part of me. I can't stop. I'm sorry. It happens a lot to me, alright? It happens. Okay, so now that we got the key, we can get going. Let's go. I swear to God. Hey! Get away from me! We're ready. I think we could I think we can defeat Hooktail this episode. It should be pretty good, so let's do it. Oh shine sprite. Alright, let me get that shine sprite. Nice.
Oh my god. <laughs> I'm actually crying. I'm nearly crying to help <laughs> want to battle I really don't want to do that. Well, that was close oh my god I know I lost my coins but like who cares I can get back more anyway who cares oh my god damn that was just wow okay let's start who dares approach me Get over that! What the hell? All right, hook tail. What's wrong with me? Okay, let's go. Hmm, so you are friends of the strange gra grabbed one who came earlier. I didn't expect more to come to steal the treasure I protect. Such rashness. That was foolish, I fear. Do you really think you can beat me? I bet you're small and you don't appear tasty. I suppose you might take a good snack. And the bottoms of your feet smell like they might make good sausage to some spices. Wait, what? What I'll do is sot you to crisp goodness until I gobble you down head first. <sighs> okay, that foot fetish is already seen equipment. Right, so yeah, Hookta has a foot fetish. Yeah, she has a foot fetish. She has a literal foot fetish. Snack times with appetizers, but which one of your more cells should I taste first? Okay, let's fight. Alright, let's go! Okay, so, her weakness. The, basically the um, the badge that we got. So doesn't matter what you aim for, you the foot or the head, but they do the same to every barrels. Bleh! That awful sound. It sounds like a cricket. How did you know? Stop this instant. <laughs> You're really bad. Food poisoning wants to get a cricket. I hate them. Oh, fight it, hooky. Just hear my cricket chirp. Please feel woozy. <laughs> Garmin. Okay. Power smash to death. Let's go. Ooh, I must not gag my portrait. You're so woozy. <laughs> I love that. Nice. Not you dare. Let's do a sweet treat. This is what it looks like. There's actually a better version that we get later on. We get a much better version of this later on in the game. With like the crystal stars that we get, but this is just the, uh, basically the, uh, basically this one is the one you get from the beginning. I won't be so bad anymore, I promise. In fact, I'm sorry for everything. Uh, yeah. To prove it, I'll give you a thousand coins. What do you say? Can you forgive me? What a thousand coins? Shit. Keep your coins, fiend. No. What? You must be joking. You don't need any coins. Then how about the lovely, rare, extra special badge I have? I'll give you that. You're really being like Mimi right now, aren't you? 
this one kind of and it's yours in limited time only. I'll take it. Oh, did I bad shit? Give it to God. <laughs> God. Wait, hold on. Uh, really? Well, I suppose I could have bothered by letting you smell the bottoms of my feet. <laughs> <laughs> no! No! Listen to the foot fetish I was talking about. People pay good money to do this. I'm being completely honest right now. Really? No! <laughs> so, care to take a whiff of the rich, yet delicate scent of my world right now? <laughs> oh, no, I don't want a foot fetish. Maybe just a quick sniff. That's disgusting! <laughs> You aren't a very trusting fellow, are you? It's important to be able to trust someone, you know? Uh, I guess it'd be better. Oh my god. Don't have a foot fetish, kids. <laughs> <laughs> there goes the audience! He heals and she heals him so. That's just not right. <laughs> ah, now my strength has returned to me. I've had enough of this. Let's finish this guy off fast, Mario. It's actually a she. It's actually a girl, by the way. A <laughs> Wow, what save? Okay. Oh my god, what the hell? <laughs> so there's no audience, so basically we're in the audience. So why do you always have to pay every time you prick it? <laughs> so basically, just as you hit him more, the audience basically starts to be released. I believe you that. Just say. I wanted to do with my life. So many meals. You did it. That's Hooktail. Wow, we actually pulled it off, Mario. Now all we have to do is find that crystal star thing you're looking for, Mario. Ooh. Ooh, it's spooky. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, I'm out. Finally out. Whoa, it it can't be. Eh? D Dad? <laughs> hey, you're you're Coops. Hey, son, you've gotten so big since I last saw. Well, yeah, I guess I have. But who cares, Dad? I mean, golly, what happened to you? Where have you been all this time? I thought you left out to get milk. <laughs> Well, I came back here a while back to do a hook tail, and that was all well and good. But just before my finishing blow, he pu pulled a trick on me and gobbled me down hole. I've been hiding in my shell for ten years since then, so I hooked his belly, and boy, was it nasty. I'm glad I finally get out. <laughs> Honestly, Dad, don't you know how we were all about you? For ten long years, we thought you, you know, we thought your game was over. I'm oh, sorry, son, but I'm okay. That's good, right? We're together now, right? Hey, speaking of which, what are you doing here anyway? Oh, come on, Dad. I came here to defeat Hooktail, who's been wrecking havoc in town. And Mr. Mario here is looking for a gem called the Crystal Star. Crystal Star? This wouldn't be what you're talking about, would it? That it? What's that? I found it down there in Hooktail's belly. Nice, huh? I kept that as a souvenir. So, this is the thing you're looking for? Perfect, just perfect. You can have it. Me? Come on, I won't take no for an answer. You're Coop's friend, please take it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah! <laughs> Alright. We got a crystal star! And you learned a special move, Earth Tremp. Well, that was a good move. That was actually a pretty good move. Pretty good move for a very beginning. Really good one, though. Really good one. Alright. Mario and his friends finally got a crystal star in the castle after defeating Hooktail. Coops even reunited with his long lost father, whom he thought was dead. Yet they weren't able to learn anything about the whereabouts of the princess. Where could the princess Peach be? 
Yes, Mars Adventure has only just begun. Alright. Okay. Great, says Rotus. We brought the Princess Peach you order, sir. Well, 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 my pet. Isn't it about time you told us where that map is? Princess Peach, you must speak when spoken to. I'm telling you, I don't know. There's no point in trying to hide it, pretty girl. We know you had it. We know this. Trust me, it is very much in your interest to be absolutely honest with us. The x nuts are not all rainbows and lollipops, and I assure you, they are quite nasty. Protus, sir, I have news. Report at once. You know the crystal star we found maybe Hookto had? Well, someone nabbed it. What? What did you say? Someone else after the crystal stars? And he defeated a Hookto creature, you say. Speak, soldier! Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. There's more, too. See, according to the report... It was a mustache dude in a red hat and blue overalls who pulled the job. Mario! Excuse me? Mario? Oh no! <laughs> I can't do that! <laughs> I see. So you do know this Mario, do you? This fool matters not at all. I'll know about him before long. That, I promise. I grow bored of talking. Take Princess Peach back to the holding room. Yes, sir! And then, take good care of Princess Peach. Understand? She's not to be harmed. You got it, sir. Well, look, Crumb. Here's this Mario character has the map. Then it's highly likely he'll find the crystal stars we're hunting in the Bogley Woods. And the search turned there immediately and packs him back to the ocean. Was that? Oh, yeah, sure. Roger, Brodus. And with that, pow, I'm gone. <laughs> okay. I wonder if sending Lord Crump is alone is wise. He is a bit helpful. Hmm. x -Nut, I summon you! Which x -Nut? There's so many of them. You rang, dude? I mean, sir. You rang, sir. Grotus, dude. Grotus, sir. Grotus, sir. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Go get the Shadow Sirens over here. The sh Shadow Sirens, sir. But they... I don't care how you plan to end that sentence, fool. Go get him now. Gotcha. The Honorable Grotus is need of us when we arrive, by delay. <laughs> Wee hee hee hee! Pray tell, did the princess tell you where the map is? Still your tongue, Belgum. You would already have it if you smashed her earlier. But now, since you missed your chance, some poor fool named Mario has the map. It wasn't my fault, truly. There are too many praying eyes there. Too many. Besides, a strange old man showed up at the moment true, and we had to retreat. What? Don't I worry. All we need to do is find this Mario and steal the map, yes? Indeed, that is your duty. If I remind you that the map is vital to the X-Mark plan, I will have my men prepare for all available information on this Mario. For now, hear me, Belgum. Your shadow stars must take care of this troublemaker. <laughs> Fear not, sire. Your ad Belgum shall return what you seek. Let's go, my lovelies, Marilyn, Vivian. Come on, we've got a job to do. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> God damn it. Okay. I don't think we'll be playing it. We'll be playing as Peach here. I think we are, right? Yeah, Peach here. Okay, those ones are going to be important for later. Obviously, I'm going to go to them. Don't get wrong. Think about yourself. Oh, dear. Here we go again. <laughs> oh, shit. Ah, shit. Here we go again. I can't believe I'm kidnapped again. Mario and Toast were supposed to be worried sick again. Again. But hang on a moment. Where in the world am I anyway? It's so familiar. I wish I could at least let Mario and Toadsworth know I forgot. Alright, so we're gonna play as Peach for a little bit. Basically, an interlude. It's gonna be a very common thing. Let's go to Disneyland. Let's go here. What a lovely shower. No soap scum even? Wow, I wonder if it works. It should work as a shower, Peach. 
Also, by the way, if you try to if you try to actually behind it, there's literally nothing. Instead sort of just peaching our dress, sh taking a shower. <laughs> yeah. Ah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Refreshing. I feel like a new princess. And after that, it's gone. <laughs> hey, what was that? Hey, how odd. Those are just something by themselves. Alright. Weird. Doesn't look like anyone's around. Making these doors open. Oh God. Okay, that's one space honestly much. Hello, Princess Peach. Huh? What? Who said that? Where are you? How amusing. I'm right here, before your eyes. I am the slap a toy screen computer. I am Tech XX. Many call me Tech. You may. Sir Grod has created me to be a perfect computer, one that is flawless in its reason. Grodus? Wait, he's that awful do dome headed thing who interrogated me, right? Okay, funny enough, in the Japanese version, Tech actually has a red or eye instead of blue, so it was changed because of the copyright. Because you know how uh, in the 2001 Space Odyssey, you know, the, you know, the AI actually has red. It was supposed to be a direct reference, however, it was changed to blue for copyright reasons. Little interesting fact there. Sir Grotus is not awful. He is a very great person. He is marvelous. Well, I don't think so. But I doubt it will change your mind, so I'm wondering, why did you leave me here? I am unsure. An unusual program deviation occurred when I observed you earlier. My higher brain circuitry malfunctioned and nearly overheated at your image. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I know what you did. Also, an unidentified impulse fed through my processors. These events are new to me. There's more to this phenomenon as well. I ran diagnostic programs, and their solution was, I want to know more about you. I want to observe you. Such as a compulsion has no presence, cause unknown, I, the perfect computer. I must diagnose their unusual situation. I will not fail. That is why I led you here. Wait, did you just say you want to observe me? To know more about me? Could it be that you... No, impossible, it can't be, you're a computer. What has happened to me? If you know my malfunction, you must tell me of it. Oh, I couldn't really, because it's just too weird. Please tell me, please. I am the world's best computer, I am perfect. There should not be anything that I do not understand, please. Well, you know, maybe it's possible that well, you're in love with me. Love? What is love? I cannot compute this. But you don't know what love is? Love? How do I explain? Love tells you when you want to be with a person forever. It makes you feel happy just to see that person happy, smiling, having fun. When you love someone, you will do anything to help when he or she is in trouble. Happiness. Fun. I have definitions for these words, but my programming is insuffi insufficient. There should be nothing I cannot comprehend. I am a perfect computer. Comprehend love. Love's not something you comprehend, Tech. You feel it. Princess Peach, will you teach me how to feel this thing you call love? What? You're a computer. Why would I care? Why would you care about love? I am perfect. There must be nothing that I cannot comprehend. Nothing. That is why you must help me understand this thing called love. Please. If you have any wishes that I can grant you in exchange, I will grant them. But of course, I am unable to grant such a wish as letting you escape. What are you insane? You ex your kidnap you like a common Koopas. And now you call me in here asking me to teach you a meaning of love. I'll just spit you in your screen. You grant my wishes? Ha! <laughs> why should I believe you? I understand you are angry. That emotion I comprehend. You're not 
You need not beat me now. But I must learn this thing. I must. There is no alternative. I must be a perfect computer. That is why, if you would just consider teaching me, I will grant your wishes. Do you understand me, Princess Peach? Now, tell me your wish. Are you sure? Well, okay. Here goes. Can I contact someone? The sooner, the better. Yes, of course you may. Use my communicator to send wireless mail to anyone you want. If you so wish, you can use it right now. It is no trouble. Use the keyboard in front of you. Enter the receipt, address, and message. How does Peach know our address, though? You mean this keyboard? All right, let me give this a try. How the hell does she know our address? Even though, okay, never mind, I don't get it. Okay, it's ready, tech. I'll just send it. The message has been sent. For the time being, you may return to your room. I will call you again when you want to ask when I want to ask you something I can't read today. <laughs> uh Okay then. Good night. Good night, Princess Peach. Oh, we have a Bowser interlude. We have two interludes, right? The Bowser interlude! <laughs> yeah. Yes, it's Bowser! Hey! Oh my god. <laughs> you got Bowser. Let's check it. the mighty Koopa King has arrived. Hold your applause, minions. Eh, but now that I'm here, Cammy, you crest the old egg, or why don't you summon me? <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, great Lord Bowser. The, uh, crusty hag Cammy took the world back momentarily. I'm really sorry for the inconvenience. Please, come into the room. Greetings to your happiness. The hag Cammy Koopa will be arriving at any moment. If you press B, you can basically reply. So the other day, I saw Lord Bowser gazing longingly at the photo of Princess Peach. You may want to put a cork in it, man. Oh, I'll tell you to look in his face when he was moaning over that thing. <laughs> uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Lord Bowser! Well, I'm dying to hear the rest of your hilarious story, Mr. Comedian. Do share. <laughs> I'm not funny, sir. He's not funny, sir. Lord Bowser, I have been training day and night to help you conquer the world. So the time come, I shall be ready. Order me as you please, your silliness. Uh, super. In that case, I order you to do some sit-ups, Tubby. <laughs> Boy, do I have a hands-less handsome side. Anyway, you look at this, it's perfect. And as well as mine, these statues are going to be mandatory in all households. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Bowser. Oh, what a profile, though this thing could use some good dusting. Huh? It looks like this eye's a little loose. Incredible, Stashy's eye is a jewel. I got a Bowser jewel. Just kidding. <laughs> Hail Lord Bowser. Lord Bowser, please, if it's not too much trouble, head to the rear of the hall. Okay, thanks. It's Cammy. All right. Ah, Lord Bowser. <laughs> Then we're gonna go in that we're gonna go ahead and save in that episode, actually. Maybe we might. Oh, I just now returned. I'm terribly sorry to keep you waiting, my lord. We're gonna go see Luigi and everyone in that episode. I bet you are candy good by now. I would think. Why have you called me here? Please, your grumpiness. Don't be impatient with your poor servant. <clears throat> it's my displeasure to report that Mario, that scum, is off to town called Richport. <laughs> I'm Mario's babysitter, I don't care what he's doing. Are you going to call me every time that guy blows his nose or what? Sheesh. Yes, well, you see, my lord, apparently Mario was hunting for an amazing treasure. The treasure? Yes, Mario has gone in search of the star-shaped jewels known as the Crystal Stars. I'm researching just what they are, but there's no question of their high value. The Crystal Stars, you say? They sound like a good world-conquering tools. I want them. Hmm, yes, very good. It's your re researching this for me, you brainiac, you. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Leave it to me. By the way, Lord Bowser, do you like fried eggs? You bet I do. Blah, I hate them. I hate them. Ugh. Ugh. I almost threw up just now. Can't stand fried eggs. But why do you ask? 
Well, during Mom and Mario Recon, I stopped at a lovely place called Petal Meadows. I was planning on taking everyone there for a picnic, having some eggs and toast. Of course, I wouldn't think sending an invite without asking you first, old Bowser. Airhead! A picnic, you moron! There's no time for fun! See, this is why my evil fair plans always derail, because you claws always goof off! Ah! Oh dear, old Bowser, please calm down. Remember your blood pressure. <laughs> What? Is this true? Lord Bowser, terrible news. Some bold fool abducted Princess Peach in Rouge Court. Uh, what? <coughs> Tell me you're lying, Cammy. How, when, where, who does such a thing besides me? <coughs> I throw. I'm afraid we don't have that information quite yet. The investigation's ongoing. One thing's most certainly confirmed, however. The princess has been kidnapped. Under no circumstances, I'll allow anyone to kidnap her without my say so. I will not stand for this. I'm going to report now. I gotta kidnap her back. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, there goes that wall. But your grimness, wait up. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and do one more thing and work in the episode. We're gonna go ahead and talk to Luigi. Yes, we're gonna talk to Luigi, alright? We're gonna start his story, and then we're gonna go in the episode there. Once it's done. And that's it. Coops, my lad, you are telling me that you're going with Mario? Um, that's right, Dad. Uh, I'm going to continue traveling with Mario. And then I'm, well, going to come back to start a strong people like you, Dad. Nice to said, young Coops. That's my boy. But always remember this. You are my son, Coops. And I'm your father. Coops, my sweet. I'll be right here waiting for you to prove yourself. <clears throat> May I just add, anything just happens, you can always come back, Coops. Don't you ever forget that. This village will always be your home. Okay, thank you, everyone. Well, I'm off. Sorry to keep you waiting, Mario. You know, farewells. So, where, where are we going? Let's head back to Rushport. Remember, Mario. The bearer of the magical map shall unfurl before the Bowser of the Lord. When this is done, the star shall guide the bearer to the crystal star of pure light. And it didn't stop there. Each crystal star shall point to the next, as the book says. Which means, if we take the crystal heart we found... The cri <laughs> crystal star, not... <laughs> back to the Bowser of the Lord. So that means the location of the next crystal star will appear in the magic map? Exactly. Come on, let's go. Okay. Let's go back. We're gonna go ahead and episode back in Pushport. So let's go. I got an email. Something's on my I'm shaking. Right? That's a new mailbox SP, isn't it? Wow, neat. Did you get some mail? My dearest Mario, I sent this letter in the hope that it reaches you safely. I'm being held against my will in some strange place. Though I do not know where I am, I remain unharmed and relatively comfort. Those who have captured me seem to be after the map to see you earlier. They may be hoping to use them to find objects they call the Crystal Stars. I do not know why they are planning, but I have a feeling it's not even positive. Mario, please collect the Crystal Stars before you do. You must. They are already aware that you have the map, so please be very careful. And please, don't worry about me. Princess Peach. Wow, you got a mail from Princess. That's so cool. So anyway, she's on her. That's good, at least. But I didn't like the sound of those kidnappers switching for the Crystal Stars as well. Alright, let's go. We're gonna go back to Rougeport. And I think we might go ahead and just end up still back in Drift War. I don't know, honestly. Because this is already a pretty long ass episode. So I'm gonna go and find a safe spot back in the corner here. Let's go. Let's go. Because I'm gonna save the Luigi story for, for the next episode. So, yeah. Let's go. Right, here we are.
I sure can't go an episode here, so anyway, I forgot to just have to stand, subscribe, and whatever. And next time, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, go back to the thousand year door and uh, basically try to find where the next location, the, the next crystal star is at. And just do other things. So maybe explore a little bit of Bruce Core before we start chapter two and all that. So, see you guys then. Bye.